Yes, definitely, for sure. Um, I could drop some names, but I'm not going to. Um, they, I don't know, I think that it can also be a personality thing, but definitely if you're, if, like if you're doing well in the industry, and if you're making a lot of money, and if you're doing really important things, it can be really easy to let that sort of thing get to your head. Or sometimes some girls feel like they're entitled to let it get to their head because they are doing these amazing things and you're not. Or some people will hate on the girls who are yeah. doing really well. Yeah, and then it just sort of makes the other good girls who are doing really well feel like they have to in order to defend themselves because maybe they feel like they're being targeted, you know, by these girls who aren't doing so great. And I know everyone says that, yeah, if I was rich and famous, I wouldn't be like that at all. But you never know until you get there. And, you know, it could come to that point where you are just trying to defend yourself. And you don't realize that you've put up this wall and you're angry and mean and you come off like that. Because it's just something that you've done all the time. I've worked with a whole bunch of girls. Yeah, I've worked with more successful girls. I've worked with... Um, uh, really, really new girls. I uh, think like I've been the most experienced one there many times. But I don't think that it makes the um, the dynamic any less equal. What about on this job? I'm going to show you a picture. So I'm not like... <laughs> this job. What about it? Do you not have <laughs> any kind of experience with preferential treatment given to the other girl. I thought I remembered you telling me that once. Well, um, I guess a bit for that job, yeah. Now you're making me sound like a hypocrite. <laughs> I was kind of young and I didn't really grasp, I, I mean I knew I was doing Vogue, but I didn't grasp how like hard it was to get because it had been up in the air a few times before and had always fallen through. So I like was just- Like on option? Yeah. And, and it had always fallen through, so I was at that point just like, you know what, whatever. And then we finally, I got it, and I was like, oh, okay. Because before it had fallen through so many times that I didn't really expect it to happen. So um, maybe I didn't fully appreciate where I was, and maybe that, maybe the photographer kind of, I don't know. I don't know. She's a Sports Illustrated model, so she's pretty famous and she's done a lot of work for them but she was never she didn't treat me like you know she was a sports illustrated model and i wasn't i didn't even know she was a sports illustrated model until after the fact the photographer i think had that sort of personality where because he was a very famous photographer who works for vogue a lot so yeah he's going to he's going to act like that himself there are a lot of girls who stick to each other, like the girls who are really successful will always stick to the girls who are other, who are really successful. And that's, that's fine, you know, because I don't want to be successful because I don't need to, so I don't feel like I have to be a part of their group.